Hello everybody and welcome to Polka Dot Pots. I'm Erin Rassiopi and today I'm going to show you how to paint this mug using the splatter technique in three easy steps. Plus, I'll tell you how you can win this awesome mug for zero American dollars. Let's get started. I'm painting the inside of the mug first, simply because it's easier to handle the outside of the mug before it's been painted. I'm painting it black with three coats and will paint right up to the edge. If you don't want to paint the inside, no problem. It would turn out white and shiny. Mugs and all of our dishware are food safe after firing and we recommend hand washing to extend the life of your soon to be favorite mug. Next, I'll paint the entire outside of the mug with three coats of red. Applying three coats of paint will result in a solid finish. And just like the inside, I'm painting right up to the top edge. Be sure to get in all the nooks and crannies of the handle, and don't forget to paint the bottom. To put a clean edge on the top of the mug, I'm going to use a flat brush to apply three coats of black. Notice how I'm dabbing the paint on with the brush versus brushing it along the top edge. Now it's time to splatter! Ask a Polka Dot Pots team member for the splatter box and grab a banding wheel. Place the mug upside down on the banding wheel. Take a round brush and load it up with paint. With a quick flick of the wrist, fling the paint to the mug. How cool is that? Be sure to rotate the mug with the banding wheel to get all sides. A tip here is to finish in a position where you're pointing at the mug. Now, this is so much fun that it's hard to stop. Make sure you cover all the sides with splatter, but don't overdo it. I'm pretty much done, but notice the handle could use a little more splatter love. In order to avoid over splattering the areas next to it, I'll shield them by holding up a piece of paper. Well, you can see why it didn't get many splatters right away. It's a pretty small target. There we go. Now I'm finished, and the piece is ready to be glazed and fired. And here's the finished product. Doesn't the splatter look awesome? And it's so easy. You can get creative and use a number of different colors for the splatter, and it always turns out great. Also, did I mention that this mug comes with a lid? Okay. Now it's time to give away this mug. If you'd like to be drinking your favorite coffee or tea out of this bad boy soon, simply answer the question of the day in the comment section below and we'll randomly pick one of you to ship this to absolutely free. The question of the day is, what would you drink out of this mug? I would drink hot chocolate with marshmallows and whipped cream. Until next time, I'm Erin Rassiopi. Happy painting.